Um, it was an honor. I mean, when uh, when I was approached to um, be in the issue, it was just it was great. I mean, I this was my first like real photo shoot I've ever done. I've never been in a magazine before, so. And what does it mean to sort of have this buzz surrounding you that you're really on the verge of blowing up as an actor? <laughs> um, it's kind of surreal, to be honest. I'm still pinching myself. I just came from the premiere of um, the film I'm in, Toy's House, and it was uh, it was amazing. So I'm, I'm just I'm so blessed to be in this position, and I'm just happy for all the opportunities I can get. And for the people who aren't here at Sundance, tell us a little bit about what the film is about and your role. Yeah, um, Toy's House is essentially a coming-of-age story about these uh, three teenage boys who run off into the woods and uh, try and build a house and live off the land. Um, and uh, needless to say, there's, you know, shenanigans ensue, it doesn't turn out well. And I play Joe Toy, and Joe Toy is just, he's an optimist at heart, but uh, he has a few setbacks along the way. Uh, he's just trying to figure out, he's trying to navigate, you know, life. He's just a regular 14 year old kid. And besides it being freezing, how has your Sundance experience been so far? <laughs> so far, so good. I only got in last night. Um, I drove from LA, which was that was exciting, and um, it's a great atmosphere. Everyone is just just passionate about film and happy to be here. And then my last question, back to the magazine. Tell me what it was like shooting with Jeff Vespa during this photo shoot. Uh, Jeff is great. Yeah, he makes it really, uh, really accessible, really easy. Um, you know, I didn't even feel like I was in a photo shoot. I was just taking pictures and having a conversation. Very cool. Thank you so much.